What's the deal? So 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Nate wakes up to a freaked out Tahitian brother from another mother of mine. <laughs> and apparently last night the waves were so big that the fucking boat ripped the buoy off the reef where it was anchored to and it was oh smashing God. against the dock. And the last time I saw it, like any waves out of the dock was back during the code red swell in, I think that was what, 2011? That is so scary. And it was psycho. So Nate, like I barely slept last night. I wake up to Nate <laughs> and Mika freaking out. <laughs> Mika somehow, with the help of Nate, gets the boat off the reef, which we're pretty sure we thought he scraped the entire bottom in this like gnarly little yeah. channel. We'll yeah. show you for later <laughs> what that looks like. And so he pets off in the dark. I start to worry about him because it's not that far to the marina. So I call Harry T. She's like, Mika's fine. He made it. They come back and Mika tells me, and Harry T tells me, Mika deserves a bonus because the waves at the marina, which is like super deep water, are breaking up over the marina. No fucking way. Yeah. Oh my god. The waves are breaking over the marina. He definitely deserves a bonus. Definitely deserves a bonus, but on another note, are we about to see code yellow? Code Somehow, code some code way. <laughs> adventure number one, <laughs> no, nearly broken boat, adventure number two, code oh. purple. And the boat's okay. The boat, and the boat good. survives. <laughs> And it's only 5.30 a.m. So the day has just begun. And it's still raining. You guys heard that. Code red freaking swell. Waves are breaking in the marina. Keep in mind, we're inside of a lagoon, inside of a reef where the waves already break, mellow out, lose their energy, and they're still breaking inside here. That is a scary freaking thought. We're going to slowly gather up all the gear. Tow board. Good thing we brought it. Hopefully those freaking fins hold. I don't know. We'll have to just go out and see it, but I don't know if I've ever towed tropes this big. So, okay, we're going to get prepped. And we'll check the cam. And basically only saw giant exploding white waters. So, I need to get out of there. I'm straight tweak level right now. Look at my freaking pupils. Dilation. There's the bus. People going about their days. Don't even realize I'm going out. I'm terrified. Adrenaline is already pumping. Feel it through my arms and limbs. I have a freaking padded suit on, as well as a Patagonia padded vest under this suit. So I got double protection. Don't have a pool vest because, I mean, it doesn't seem like the hold downs are what you should be worried about. It's so much as just an impact somewhere. Gotta clean this. So we protected ourselves there. Hopefully enough. And. We're gonna go get eyes on it. Imagine. A Lucas for sure, along with this circle. This entire dock. This entire dock is moving. And we're off. <laughs> Good to go. Look at the amount of current moving in this lagoon. Ripping sideways towards the exit and through the passes which create the waves. Yeah, yeah, it's current <laughs> It's insane. It's locked up. <laughs> Friday the 13th. Friday the 13th. There was code red, there was code block, and now there's the Friday the 13th swell. <laughs> no, we're still in the current, it's just deeper here. R.I.P. Canoe. Look at those freaking salt yeah, sprays.
session one down, paddle session. We're gonna cruise midday at 12 peaks, so that'll be the tow time. We got Tahare, our driver, Masi on the ski shooting for now. We already freaking scored, so it's a good damn day. Worth the trip. <laughs> it's worth the trip it's yesterday the evening, trip. and it's double worth the trip this morning. <laughs> Conditions, as good as they get. You guys are in for a treat right here. We're gonna film a freaking bomb. Oh, here we go! Oh! No way! No way! Oh! 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 Holy shit! Dress shoes on for sure, yeah. Kind of pinch, huh? Yeah. That was the biggest cause wave. 100%. It was, yeah. The cause wave is more makeable, but that was the biggest cause wave. I was there when Kong got his Was baby. that Kali? Yeah. Is that Kali? Oh, there is Dom in their little boat. Hey, guys, sleep, sleep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sleep that way. Where is Dom in a little boat? Dom and Angela. Give it. Give us this. Give us this. Give us this. Give us
Good. So less, crazy. So less. I know. It's handling. The tent, gotta take it away. What? Into the trees. This thing's so no. dark. Look at that. It? It's still going out there. Who posted that? Raymana live. No, that's an old one. That's an empty, yeah? No, it's just not, I think. Russo, I think Russo did it. Okay, here's the breakdown. We came here. We chased this well. It was difficult to get in. Yesterday we decided that the trip had already been worth it. We wake up today, as good as it gets for tow conditions. So, pretty much. We're winning beyond winning. I didn't know what to expect from towing. I wanted to get a bomb, but I really didn't want to get one after I saw a Kaali Vast wave. It was so big and sketchy, and another guy had a wipeout after that. I was like, ah, I don't know if I want one. Ended up getting on the rope and got like everything I could have wished for out of a tow. Shout out to my driver, Kahure. Whipped me in perfect positioning, perfect speed, everything. My first wave, I even got the annihilation through the right, popped up in the lagoon. I wasn't looking for that, but I'm glad I went through it. Second wave, as good as a tow wave could be, just conditions, glass, everything. Impossibilities. <laughs> Me and Mossy, we worship the sun all day, so we don't know if we'll recover for tomorrow. Hopefully we don't have sun poisoning. Dude, the trip's not over. In the next episode, you guys are gonna get to see another big paddle day. This is crazy. This is what's going on at the freaking boat harbor. The amount of water moving. That's a dock right there. That's usually completely four foot out of the water. Oh, there in the distance, you can see it still going off. Oh my god, this old Lucas do flying air out the bat of a wave. He's still going out there. <laughs> <laughs> 